this in the background I'm actually about to start cleaning so today is Sunday February 7th and it is 3 37 p.m. and today is actually my first off day so for the past four days I worked 48 hours as you guys saw I went to Smoothie King and I got myself the peanut power plus chocolate smoothie and this drink basically just tastes like a Reese's peanut butter cup it's just so good today I'm planning on going to the gym I really need to clean my room because it is actually a disaster and I have homework that I need to do so right now it's 3 40 which means I have very limited sunlight left so I need to just hurry up and start getting stuff done because I want to get to the gym before the sun sets so I have this huge load of laundry that I need to get done and then I have a bunch of other clothes on my bed so I need to go out and figure out what's dirty and what isn't I think these are clean but you know when you do like the smell test yeah these are clean because sometimes I don't know did I wear this did I not wear it was I gonna wear it you know when you like try on a shirt but then you don't want to wear it so you just like throw it and then try another one and then you're like no I don't like that one so you throw it and then you find another one this is what happened with these clothes so you need to figure that out make my bed about to go to the car wash and wash my car I need to wash it and I also need to vacuum the inside and kind of clean over you know everything so I'm gonna be doing that I cleaned my room as you guys saw and I threw my laundry into the washer then hopefully by the time I get back which honestly it probably won't be ready but hopefully It'll be ready from the washer so I can just throw it into the dryer. After that, I'm going to get, well, I'm actually already ready. As you can see, I'm wearing different clothing, but I think that I'm going to go straight to the gym after I get back from putting my laundry into the dryer if it is ready. <laughs> gym outfit for today I just have on this white pullover jacket thing I got this at Marshall's when I went to Corpus Christi then I have on these black leggings I also got these leggings at Marshall's I believe they're super super soft and like really really stretchy material I just have on my Nike shoes that I've been using for the gym and that is the fit for the gym I have made it to the gym. I'm sitting outside of the gym right now and I'm really dreading to go in because I have not worked out 
in about two weeks or two and a half weeks. I'm about to take my pre-workout. As usual, I take my Total War pre-workout. I got this on Amazon, and if you guys want, I can leave it linked down below for you guys to purchase. Today, because it is my first day back, I really want to get a good pump, so I'm going to do probably not a full scoop, but close to a full scoop. Let me see if you guys can see that. So it's not like a full scoop, but it's like really close to it. bowl with teriyaki chicken and white rice. Okay, anything else? Uh, that should be it. Okay, your total is going to be six ninety three. Okay, thank you. Ciao, and I am currently dying. That workout was actually pretty good. I feel like the pre-workout really helped me because my heart was like really pumping and I was sweating a lot too. Thank, thank you. you. Alright, here we go. All right, so here's my teriyaki chicken. Then they gave me some teriyaki sauce. And then I have my little fortune cookie and then my fork. And I'm gonna go ahead and just eat this and watch some YouTube. So I went ahead and cut up the chicken into little square pieces, like bite-sized pieces, instead of having the big chicken strips. Panda Express, but I didn't finish all of it. I just ate like three fourths of the bowl, so there's still some left, or almost half. I ate about half of it because now that I'm looking at it, it looks like half. Um, but I need to clean Coco's cage out. Coco is my hedgehog. If you guys didn't know, I have a hedgehog, so I'm gonna show you guys how I clean out her cage. That back there is her litter box, there's the poop and whatnot. These are some of her toys right there, and then there's one under the litter box. There's her little food tray, and I have a mat. Um, she has litter on all over there, and then some poop in that corner. She's actually under here. She's not going to be very happy when I wake her up. She doesn't like to be woken up. Oh, this is her little sloth toy. There she is. Hi, Coco. There she is. So here she is. It's really easy for me to pick her up because she knows me very well now. Here's Coco. Oh, she probably smells the chicken on my fingers. This is not going to be good because she's going to try to bite me. Oh, she's so cute. There she is. Yeah, she definitely smells a chicken on my fingers. And I'm going to go ahead and bathe her. Love her so much. Look at her. She's like the cutest thing ever. She's going in for her bath. She knows what time it is because we do bath time every month. She doesn't like bath time. But we still do it because she needs to get cleaned. I use a toothbrush to 
brush out her quills so I'll take some soap and then I'll put it on her quills and I'll just brush down then I will just look at her feet because sometimes she'll have some poop stuck to her feet today she doesn't then I'll put her back in the water and I will put more soap on her kind of rub her around you're okay here she is so I'm gonna keep her in this blanket while she dries up you guys look at her she's literally the cutest thing in the world I took the top of the cage off so now I'm just gonna take out her food and then that poop stuff I'm gonna put in the toilet and then I'm gonna take this mat and all of that is gonna go also in the toilet so I'll just show you guys how I do that really quickly put the mat out and then I dump okay so now we're just left with this and then I dump out all the poop Throw the rest in there. Then I just flush it. And then this is what we're left with afterwards. I'll just spray her litter box and then I'll spray over here. So I'll just let that sit for a second. She's just chilling while I'm cleaning her home. Then I just take this scrub and I'll scrub out everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Now that her mat is clean and her little cage is clean, I'm going to go ahead and put the mat back in here and then I'll be right back. I use this cat litter right here. I got this from Petco. And then this is the cat food that she's been eating. So here she is about to go in her home. I'm going to go ahead and put her back in. There she goes. Usually for a second she'll just explore and be like, wow, mom cleaned my home. And then I also have a clean blanket for her because she likes blankets. She likes to hide under them. I just got all of my laundry out of the dryer and I actually have a ton, a ton of clothes that I need to put away. So I'm all showered up. I took a shower, I exfoliated, I shaved, I did the whole nine yards and I feel amazing. I have my homework that I need left to do tonight and then I will be done for the rest of the night.